Hi guys, this is Patrick for Room. I'm gonna show you tonight how to create your own room. So first you need to start the application. By default the home page is room.prams.com. That's the home page of the uh, the software. Uh, you can download the binaries there. So what you do is you uh, unzip the, uh, the, the, uh, the zip file if you've downloaded the zip file. I'm currently running under Linux so uh, I need to create a link to FFmpeg so I can see multimedia but for now we just keep things quite simple so you first need to create a map so I created folder here and uh, you basically have to create a text file with the extension WRM oh darn it's a bit slow is it my own? Is, ah, I think it's already opened uh, let me see there we go so you create in a folder a, a, a text file that is called uh, with the extension WRM by default map is the default name and at least have two uh, uh, two pictures two images to create wall textures so let's open that text file and we'll start with this um, the syntax is quite easy. Uh, you can download ones I al already have on the web, but let's start from scratch. So let's give a name to that place. This is my new room. And then uh, we need to define the textures. So it's called um, texture. Oh, no, that's not texture. Oh darn, what is the syntax again? Can't remember. Uh, texture, yeah, like that. Equals wall01.png texture equal wall04.png I need one for the floor. Let's pick wall04.png and then and I need one for the top ceiling equals wall 04 dot png so you can create anything else but that's kind of that's an, a simple example so no, now we need to create a map map equals and what you do is you create a small map using numbers and the number is the uh, texture number you have at the top. Let me create something simple. Control C and then Control V. So one does represent the first texture you have in your list here. Two would represent the second one and since we only have two I can work with that. So if you want to create space where you can walk in so let's put zeros in there that I'm currently working on the uh, on uh, and uh, a map a room a room editor so it would be easier to create rooms but for now it's just quick a quick test so let's add in the corners the textures here oops need to keep that space open two two so that's that should work for a simple room. So now go in your browser, file, open. I need to go on my desktop since it's a local file, and then open the map and and it didn't work. What did I do? I think everything was working. File home, huh? map 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 oh floor maybe I kind of tripped over that oh there we go that was the problem so oh I forgot to put a, a starting point so let's start equals one with one that will be at the location one dot one save that and reload 
there we go so now I have the starting point and you see the map that has been that has been constructed here so I can move around let's say I would want to have a link uh, let's say let's start with an image um, and I would say add text create a div that's uh, basic HTML, HTML darn where are those here no uh, like that yeah there we go so let's create a div in H basic HTML div and then let's enter some text hi this is a text and uh, oh I forgot the location so we'll put that at location 0 0.3 comma and save that and if we reload the world it's here at the top really small so I want to change that by default so why I did create a divs for this thing equals going to change that font size 36 pixels color blue uh, save then reload that and there we go I'm still working on the few tweaks to have the text showing up properly but you get the idea of how it works uh, I could do the same thing also. Let's say text equals 0 0.4, comma 4, and then I'm going to put an image here. Um, there, it's, there we go. Image source equals something width equals 512. G H E E H E I G H T equals that's the resolution of a uh, single tile. So oh I need the URL now. Uh, let's pick one from the website. HTTP uh, room dot crumbs dot com slash I think it's called logo png. I'm not sure. It's something like that. Kind of forgot to validate. So it seems that yeah, got it. So I loaded the logo over the wall. Does even support transfer uh, the alpha channel. So as you can see, I have it here. So I could make it smaller. Let's say reduce that. 256 256 so I'm using an external source from the website or any other website to show the image let's say now I want to have uh, a teleport teleport equals then I'm gonna put it at one zero one two three four five six zero one two three four at six four six four and the URL http uh, slash slash room dot crumbs dot com coma then I can give a title R room home base let's save that then reload and I've created teleport where is it oh maybe I put it outside darn what did I do six four HTTP that should work like that. Maybe I forgot to save or I miscount 
the location so maybe it's in the middle here so let's check that again that's six zero one two three four five six zero one two three four okay let's try that again and let's put it at one dot one see if I did something wrong teleport yeah everything should be okay there we go I don't see the teleport key. what did I do hate HTTP that's the URL teleport mistaken let's remove the title normally it, it does work I'm gonna have a look at what I have on the website okay, let's try that again teleport should be here so one dot one oh the wrong version. I have the version 0.0.11, but that should work anyway. Okay, let's see on the website. Um, I did something, I just don't know what it is. Okay, let's start with Ah, darn. Room. There we go. And I want to see the file slash math.wrm. There we go. Textures. Map. Oh, that's the action teleport. Oh, my bad. Kind of forgot. That's the, the syntax is action equals teleport and then should work so it should be behind me there we go got a teleport to create it for the main website and uh, you can give a title room home base save that reload that room There we go. So we can do the same thing if action equals browse at another, another location. Let's try 64 this time and let's enter the URL HTTP um, slash slash room.crumbs.com save it uh, reload and since this is a web link it, it will show as a star with the URL at the top so if you double click it or press the, key, the uh, action key which is the spacebar almost there that's the web view it, the first time it's a little bit slow to show up but eventually it does work so you see I can show a website. Um, I can have media playing. I can have. There are a lot of things that you can do. If you do have a look on the main website, I have almost everything here: background sound, uh, more textures. Uh, you can load several textures to create an animation. Um, the different actions are sound, teleport, door. I can create a door. Uh, you have message, media, to play a media. Um, there's a lot that you can do and even here I created like complex text overlays using HTML to create the uh, home page. So once you have done that, that once you have created <coughs> the room that you want, let's load 
that browser. So once your room is uh, working as expected, all you need to do is to upload those files to a web server using FTP or whatever and then provide the, R uh, the URL for uh, loading that file, map.wrm. can be anything else. But by default, I use map.wrm. And then the, your viewers would simply have to enter the full URL, URL here, and then they would be able to browse and see your site. So if I go back to the main website, there we go. See, I've added a few teleports here. I have uh, a few links here and there. There aren't what's happening to my network. It's a bit slow right now. I should see the image from my Twitter account. And here, something went wrong with that room. I don't know what happened, but let's reload it to see if uh, my computer is overheating right now. Oh, there we go. So maybe I have a small glitch to fix. So that's basically how it works. Uh, see the examples from the main website by loading the uh, room file and you can create your own quite easily. If you do so, uh, please post your link uh, in the description of this video or on Twitter. You can share the link with me and I'm going to share it and link here to the main room. So uh, eventually I'm going to make it a little more beautiful. I don't know if you've seen, but I do have uh, one that is dedicated dedicated to the planet Mars. If you go inside that room, then you have to figure out how to get out of that uh, that labyrinth I created. I actually don't know where the exit is myself, but uh, you can do it directly. Uh, try to find it so you can can create your own rooms and. Uh, See, this one is more uh, does look a little bit better because it has been created with uh, Mars, the planet Mars in mind. So that's how you so you would create your files, your textures, then put your overlays everywhere, and then uh, share share the, the link with your uh, to your friends. So thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed that uh, tutorial on how to create your own room and simply put that on the web and then people will be able to see uh, your room using the room browser which is currently version 0.0.11 .0 thank you for watching hope you enjoyed see you another time bye